I'm not using my headset for this one. <sighs> or, I don't know. The past couple of hours have been kind of fucked up. Not drug induced, obviously, because I don't really do that. Don't need to. If I had to pinpoint where my emotions were, I feel alone. This is weird. Because I have a girlfriend. And if you have a girlfriend, you technically shouldn't feel alone, but I do. Because I don't have anybody I can talk to about how I'm really feeling. Legal suicide. Fun. Now I'm just in a state of mind. A couple of years ago, something happened. Somebody who I should have stood up for and said, hey, you can't do that. I didn't say that, and that person was exposed to something that, that wasn't good. And during this time, I was really messed up. I was just off my medication. Like, I was just watching it all. Like, I was on... Like, I was watching a TV show or something. Like, I, I couldn't influence it. I couldn't do anything. I couldn't say stop. I couldn't say... Don't do that. And since then, that has been one of my driving forces to be better. To be able to help people... Who are helpless, people who don't know any better, people who need someone else to stand up by them, not for them necessarily, just by them. And now I'm seeing the same person. And I don't know if I'm, if I'm just overreacting, you know? I can't even talk about it. Because if I, if I am wrong, If I am wrong, it will cause such a shit show, show. It's unbelievable. And if I'm right, this shit show would it be even worse. And what's, what's worse than all of that? All of that. I'm not sure that the person who I wanted to protect even wants protecting because it's something that they are doing. It's something that they are making a choice about. A conscious daily choice. So I'm always, I, I, I've been asking myself, what am I supposed to do? I thought I was doing the right thing by kind of just stepping back and staying out of things, but it's bugging me. Like when someone says something and you go, oh no, that's not possible. And you see and you second guess it. And the implications alone could be detrimental to many people. But once again, maybe I'm just overreacting. Maybe it's fine. Maybe it's okay and I'm just messed up and it's none of my business. And when it comes down to it, maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's just none of my business. I am literally just some guy who lives in a tower. So who am I to say left, right, or sideways about anything? I don't know.
is none of my business. It's none of my business, and I should just turn a blind eye. Because I don't know. Like, I don't know. If I knew, it'd be different, but I, I don't. I feel utterly helpless. It's not my life. It's somebody else's, and that's, and that's where it has to be, right? Somebody else's life. And if somebody else wants to make choices that I might not approve of, is it really my place to step in and say anything? Maybe I'm not a good friend. Oh, well. I have my own shit to deal with, right? All right, that's what I got time for. Got other things to worry about. Catch you guys later.